If I was to tell you that I could leap over a building, a skyscraper, in a single bound, that I could run a marathon in under two and a half hours, and that I could do 200 push-ups in a row, you'd probably have good reason to be skeptical of my claims. But if I then took you to a building and I leaped over it in one single bound, you'd probably say to me, wow, okay, you, you don't have to do the marathon or the push-ups. I, I believe you because you were able to do that one thing. We are celebrating the Easter season, the resurrection of our Lord. And one thing that Easter proves is that Jesus is the Son of God. And so you can believe what he says. Jesus one time said, destroy this temple and I will raise it again in three days. But the temple he was talking about was not the temple made with stones in Jerusalem. The temple he was talking about was his own body. And so on that first Easter Sunday morning when Jesus walked from the tomb, he demonstrated that his word is true. He fulfills what he says. And so for that reason, you can believe all of the other claims that Jesus made. You can trust God's word when Jesus tells you that your biggest problem is sin. It's not your finances or your personal relationships, but rather it's where you've broken God's law. But you can also believe and rejoice in Jesus' other promises to you when he says, I have forgiven all of your sins at the cross. And you can believe his words to you when he says, one day I'm going to send my angels to lift you up and take you to be with me in heaven. Amen.